something a little different. We're gonna do some either or questions. All right. Okay. All right. DC or Marvel? Um. Oh man. I'd have to say DC. Marvel. Marvel. Uh, Marvel. Marvel. It's DC because Batman. Red or blue? Blue. Blue. Uh, blue. Red. Well, I'm wearing blue right now, but um, red. Star Wars or Star Trek? Uh, Star Wars. Oh, Star Wars all the way. Star Wars. Star Wars. That seems to be the popular opinion. Star Wars. Star Wars. Good choice. Pepsi or Coke? Coke. American football or the world football? Um, I guess the world football. Pancakes or waffle? It's toast. What's so great about toast? It's just that you don't get filled up for the rest of your breakfast when you when you go out to breakfast. And hot dogs or hamburgers? Hamburgers. Celsius or Fahrenheit? Uh, Fahrenheit. Awesome. Fahrenheit. Blazing hot or freezing cold? Freezing cold. All right. Would you rather be really, really small or really, really tall? Probably really tall. Why? Because I'm already above average height. <laughs> Illinois or California? Uh, uh, Illinois. Okay. <laughs> I don't and like then... Illinois. <laughs> Me or my brother? Uh, um, uh, can I do both for that one? <laughs> <laughs> sure you can. Good luck for the race. Thank you so much and good luck. Good luck with the race. Thank you so much and good luck with the race. Thank you. Thank you so much and good luck. Good luck again.
got Rick on me. Connor is slowly pulling away. How many laps, man? How many laps? You have three laps left. Uh... What's the gap between me and the guy behind me? Uh, not even one car. He's up right there. Alright. Because I can't see him at all. If I feel left side, he's coming from the for July, Shelton Lewis. Congratulations, Shelton. Thank you. How was the race? How was the night? The night was better than before. Um, this is the third time we've been on the podium this year, so that's an improvement from uh, a couple of months before. So um, the race was also well. Um, me and Connor had a little uh, team strategy, well, not really team strategy, but interpersonal strategy. Um, we're still trying to catch Eric. Um, that's been our objective since it first started. Um, but yeah, we um, we made the agreement that if you know someone has a better cart than than someone, then we'll let them buy, let them try to catch Eric. If not, give the position back. And we'll actually fight for it. Okay. Um, so that that was really good teamwork. It was kind of fun watching you guys trade places every once in a while. Um, I have to ask, what's with the French flag? So, I'm not French born, but the World Cup is here, and I'm rooting for France because my great grandmother was French, and I, she died when I was little, so I kind of wanted to do it out of her respect, and you know, because I, I, I've heard that she loved me and I was just like her, so. That's really sweet, and good luck to France, and good job, and I will see you in August. Yep, August. Oh, right. wait, um, maybe, maybe not. Uh, update, uh, my birthday is in August 2nd, so I may be here or may not. It depends. It's a little surprise. All right. Yep. Maybe they can make a cake. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, cake's coming if I come. Okay. Yeah. Well, uh, good luck and good night. Thank you. And in second place, Connor. Congratulations, Connor. Thanks. How was the night? How was the race? How was everything? Uh, qualifying went really well. Did uh, that was actually my better time. So qualified with my position on the first heat of qualifying, and uh, that stuck and kept me in second. Well, it was, it was first when I ran initially, and then Eric ran his better time um, in his second heat. So it just bumped me down one spot. Started the race and uh, had good pace through a couple of the corners, and then all of a sudden, when I was going through a lot of the harder corners like the chicane, turn uh, turn two isn't as sharp, but it's a fast corner the rear tires were just stepping out and Eric was, I was gaining speed on him in turn five, turn four and turn five, but then, you know, going through the chicane and getting into, getting into the throttle in the chicane and then getting into the throttle on turn two, it, it was just stepping out and I was losing all my speed when it would step out. So I was fighting it, fighting it, fighting it and I saw Shelton on me and we've wanted to, you know, catch up to Eric in points for a while now because him and me are like neck and neck. So we're, uh, trying to catch the massive gap that Eric has over us and uh, 
So I was like, okay, I'll let him pass because he, he obviously has got you know better grip, same power, better grip. Let's let let him go. So I got over the side in the straight. He passed me, and I you know got in right behind him. And then he tried that, and then he started losing power. But I was start my rear tires were starting to warm up. So then we, you know, he let me pass in turn one again. So I started to go, and then I, I was starting to get a decent rate race pace. But there just wasn't enough laps left in the race to do anything useful with it. So <laughs> second place, good finish. So you still get all the points, and mm -hmm. it was it, it was a good night overall, wouldn't you say? Yeah, it was it was good clean good clean racing. No major power failures. Everyone had fast good carts good traction and i was talking to the manager and he was saying that they just did new tires different softer compound uh replaced a lot of the batteries and it shows they had really all the carts were fast they would you know it was in that competitive zone where it's supposed to be you know 192s 193s and that was you know obviously apparent that those carts are have been treated to long-term maintenance that they've needed so well, that's really good, and congratulations again. Yeah, thanks. And I'm here with the winner of the July race of 2018 in Addison, Eric. How are you doing, Eric? Uh, pretty good. How was the night for you? Um, pretty much kind of the same. Uh, I couldn't really complain about any of the cards I had. I had a really strong one for qualifying, had a strong card for the finale, so no complaints. Uh, how was the race for you? How, um, was there any struggle to get to the, you know, as far ahead as you did? Uh, no, the cart behaved pretty well. The steering was a little tight, so I got a bit of a workout in my forearms, but other than that, it was definitely fast. I mean, I set a faster lap in the race than I did in qualifying, and that was without doing, like, the little sh shortcut, like, strategy we do in turn one. So it was definitely a very quick cart. Good. Congratulations. And you'll be back for August? Yep. All right, thank you so much. Congratulations.